A long time ago, people didn't have disaster warning systems. They relied on oral tradition to remember the signs of an impending disaster. In 1907, an earthquake occurred off the west coast of Sumatra and created a tsunami that destroyed the south coast of Similu. This gave birth to the legend of the Smalm, a word meaning tsunami in the Devayan language. When you feel a strong earthquake shaking the ground and seawater is receding, run away from the beach as far as possible. This would be the warning for future generations of sea maloons. However, scientists at the Earth Observatory of Singapore studied seismic signals and historical newspaper records from 1907 that described two separate earthquake events surrounding the tsunami on that fateful day. Engelbertus Schroeder, a Dutch official, reported a weak, long-duration earthquake followed by three tidal waves that were then followed by a violent, strong, shaking earthquake. Over time, the two earthquakes were mingled into one dramatic and violent earthquake that was then described in the Smog legend, despite the fact that the tsunami came from the first earthquake that the people could barely feel. And although the Smong legend has been recognized to still have protected the Similuan people from the 2004 Indian Ocean tsunami, scientists hope to highlight the importance of recognizing the different types of earthquakes that cause tsunamis and to contemporize disaster mitigation efforts for vulnerable coastal communities.